An inferno is still raging uh, in uh, the Lagos on the Lagos Abadan Expressway. Hours after two tankers laden with petroleum products collided with each other. The accident occurred at about 5.30 p.m. under the Shagamo Interchange Bridge and motorists fled out of their vehicles due to panic. The incident has caused traffic as uh, firefighters battle to quell the inferno. Officials of the Federal Road Safety Corps are at the scene and motorists have been advised to use alternative route until the situation normalizes. Tuenugu State now where police there have paraded a middle-aged woman, Amaka Otolehi, who was caught in a viral video maltreating her housemaid. The suspect claimed she never meant hurt to the little girl. Correspondent Bamidelia Jai sent in this report. The video went around showing the suspect thrusting the little girl out of her car and on the floor. She went ahead to show affection to her crying baby. It was revealed that the girl was handed over to the family by her uncle from Plata State, who serves as an agent. The suspect, a native of Ungobala in Imo State, admitted she threw the little girl out of her car, but said she never meant to hurt the eight-year-old house help. I'm pulling this knife to help her. It's not what, it's not, I don't know what came over me. It's not what you saw. This is not me. This is not the way I live. I only came into her life to help her, please. I was supposed to travel, but I didn't. So, we decided that we will have to first make sure the girl is okay. We went and scanned her, both her skull and her chest, and we made sure that a doctor saw her. The Commissioner of Police said the act has attracted local and foreign attention. A middle-aged woman on with a blue car was maltreating and throwing away on the ground, thrusting this little girl on the ground. And uh, there was also a little baby on her hand who seemed to have fallen from a stationary car. So this video that went viral attracted so many comments on social media. As an eight-year-old, the girl is too young to be taken away from her parents and undertake any form of job under the law of the country. The police is exploring the chances that the child was trafficked by her uncle for material benefits. Maybe he wanted to sell her and then use the money as he has nothing doing. And he is not even married to say that he would bring his uh, uh, relations children to be under his care. While the family that uh, he gave, they claim that they received this girl to help them in house help. Is this girl big enough to be employed? This is typical example of child abuse. The said uncle to the victim lamented that the family he trusted to take care of his niece would treat her in that manner. As I watched this video, tears were just coming out from my eye. So, is it uh, this auntie that I know her? Is she the one that will do this kind? Uh, 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 is she the one that is, she's going to do this kind of behavior? As in, to behave in this way? I didn't know her with this kind of attitude. So I did not even believe it. This is just one of the countless underage Nigerian children working as domestic servants in cities across the nation, far from their own parents and homes. The sad reality is that many of these children end up being abused and abandoned to their fate, hence the need for government to be firm in protecting vulnerable children.